What's up, Cats Money Army? Welcome back to my channel. Let's kick off the new year by setting up three passive income sources. That's right. It will make your accounts explode. Stop playing around. Hit the like and subscribe. Without further ado, let's get into the video. The first passive income source we will set up is Schwab Value Advantage Money Fund. This is actually considered a mutual fund. The stock ticker symbol is SWVXX. I'm currently on Schwab website. This fund has a net expense ratio of 0.34%. So the objective for Schwab Value Advantage Money Fund is the fund's goal is to seek the highest current income consistent with stability of capital and liquidity. And here are some of the highlights. Seek to generate current income while maintaining liquidity. Invest in high quality short-term money market investments issued by U.S. and foreign issuers. Actively manage benefiting from extensive credit research and professional money management. And let's see what else we got here. So they have a seven day yield with waivers. And this is as of December 30th, 2022. It's about 4.27%. And then they also have a seven day yield without waivers as of December 30th, 2022, 4.25%. Well, that's really not much of a difference. Let me make one thing clear. The 4%, that doesn't mean that's how much percentage you would get returned within seven days. Because this is a money market fund, the rate changes. And that's why this is saying the past seven days, on average, is actually calculated as 4.27%. For example, if we were to invest $100, towards the end of one year, we would get roughly $4.27. That's what this number means. Here are some things to keep in mind. Schwab money fund, pays out on the 15th of each month. According to Y charts, the average annual return for Schwab money fund is 1.52% with an expense ratio of 0.34%. Dividend yield 1.03%. Since last week, I had deposited $500 towards my Schwab money fund. On your mobile app, click on the upper right hand icon and then just type in the ticker SWVXX. Now keep in mind, this is actually more like a mutual fund. So when you put an order in, it wouldn't transfer right away. A lot of times these mutual fund managers execute your trade for, towards the closing of the stock market. Let's say for example, we wanted to buy $500 worth. Well, once we navigate to our stock ticker, click on trade, it shows my valuable cash investment amount. And it also displays the a mutual fund ticker. On action, click on buy. That's one of the beauty of Schwab money market fund. There is no minimum. So I could put as little as $1, which I've tried before. Just for demonstration purpose, I'll put in $500. Click on review order. It will ask you to verify your order. So yes, yeah, 500 quantity. The market value is $500. The symbol is SWVXX. It's a buy transaction. Trade date is on January 3rd, 2023. I have my dividends reinvested and capital gains reinvested. This means that when I receive dividend payments, these dividends get added back into my initial principal and it will continue to grow at a faster rate. Schwab is one of many money market funds. There are several of them out there. I mainly use Schwab because I have a checking account with them as well as my Roth IRA. This makes it easy for me to transfer cash between my checking account and investment account. For our second passive income source, I will be setting up a PayPal savings account. I had already transferred $500 to my PayPal savings account last week. And also I have an additional $500 pending and this should hit my PayPal savings account by the end of this week. Now currently PayPal offers a generous annual percentage yield of 3.75%. 3.75% is huge. I mean, that's one of the highest saving accounts interest rate I've seen. 3.75%. Now, I have also mentioned this in my previous videos. PayPal offers the finance technology services. They are not the bank. They actually team up with Synchrony Bank. Synchrony Bank is the actual bank that holds your money. I am so impressed with this app features. I've raved about it so many times and I will do it again. The next app that we will focus on is Yada. On Yada, I had already deposited $500 last month. Because I am so impressed, I will double down my investment. I will add an additional $500 to my Yada savings account. Just by adding another $500, it will push my investment total to $1,000. By having $1,000 in my Yada's account, it will give me 40 tickets a night. 40 tickets is a lot. 
There's 40 ways for me to win money. My all-time interest payment is $1.20. Wow, check out the leaderboard. This dude, Benjamin F., he earned $985.99. Can you imagine making $985 on interest? Easy money right there. Cha-ching. Transferring money to Yada is pretty simple. I'll click on transfer. And then click on deposit funds. And it's asking me to put in the dollar amount that I want. I'll put in 500. Ask me to verify my deposit from account. And then verify my deposit to. Let me click on the drop down box. So core account is the only option here. Now I have already clicked on deposit a few minutes before recording this. I have about six hours to the next drawing. Can't wait. I went from 20 tickets a night to now 40 tickets a night. See on average, my account accumulates anywhere from three to seven cents a night. By having 40 tickets, I'm expecting my average dollar amount to range from five cents to 10 cents. Cha-ching. And also Yada's savings, PayPal savings, is similar to the Schwab Money Market Funds, where there is no minimum deposit. So you could transfer as little as $1 or transfer as much as $10,000. Let me recap this real quick. For the Schwab Money Market Fund, ticker is SWVXX. I've deposited $500. For PayPal savings, I've deposited $1,000. For my Yada savings, I've deposited $1,000. That gives us a total of $2,500. By setting up $2,500 in a fixed income account, let's see how much money can we earn by the end of January. Cats Money Army, thank you for your time. Happy New Year's, and I'm out. I will see y'all next time. And once again, there are 1,000 ways to make money. Cha-ching!